The average person consumes literally 200 pounds of this stuff per year. I mean, just check this out. Maltodextrin on the glycemic index is way above sugar. Okay, sugar is like 75. Then you have glucose, which is 100. But maltodextrin goes between 140 to 180. And it's not even classified as a sugar. And this is why people who've never even had one drop of alcohol on their lips can develop a fatty liver or even advanced cirrhosis. It's coming from something else. All right, so now let's show you how to fix it. Number one, stop snacking, especially on carbohydrate snacks. If you go in the grocery store, there's entire aisles of these snacks. We have sugar, starch, and also just eating too many frequent foods will increase insulin. So every time you eat, you spike insulin. Number two, we need to stop eating sugar, starch, and stop consuming seed oils too. Seed oils also can cause an insulin problem as well because it affects the receptors in the liver and that can cause insulin resistance, which then causes your body to make more insulin. And so as we do this, we start lowering insulin. What do we replace it with? High quality protein, animal protein, meat, fish, eggs, cheese. Vegetables have phytonutrients. They have potassium, folate, vitamin C. A lot of people do better with fermented vegetables and cruciferous vegetables.